Now guys, we're going to get into my rundown tomorrow as far as how we did. I mean, I think I'm looking like I pretty much did the same that I did last week. It's looking like that, um, but we'll see. I mean, I I was right on on a lot of games, and a lot of games surprised me. They they went in in such ways that I did not expect them to go. Um, all of the uh, the Carolina game, I did not see the the Panthers coming out and actually showing a, a dominating performance. Honestly, that was that was a completely dominating performance by both Cam Newton and by Christian McCaffrey, and I was surprised. I thought the uh, Ravens were going to come in there with the number one defense and just run away with it. Uh, but with that being said, that's not why we're here. Uh, we are here because I got something that seriously grinds my gears right now, guys. My Packers, and I said this in my prediction video, like, I'm picking the Rams. So technically, I was right. But at the same time, I was like, I wouldn't be surprised. I would not be uh, hurt if, if the Packers actually went in there and won it. And I was right on both fronts, guys. I was right because there is no one, no one in America that could that would doubt that if Rodgers had that ball, they were going to march down the field and get at least a field goal. Rodgers was putting on such a performance in this game that he was just like, wow. Now, to be fair, Jared Goff and Todd Gurley and Robert Woods were amazing. They were flat out amazing. And I'm not taking anything away from that team because they, they were really good. And their special teams stepped up huge in that game. And that's what makes it hard because I'm a, I'm a California boy. We have a team in L.A. finally. I want to support them, even if they're in the same conference as my favorite team. But yesterday, literally, this game came down to Ty Montgomery. I am honestly surprised today, guys, and this is not me from a fan's perspective. This is not me from a, a, a Packers perspective being like, oh, you should be benched, you should be off the team, nothing like that. This is from a pure analytical perspective. From everything that has been said, Ty Montgomery was told, kneel down, give the ball to Aaron. Ty Montgomery goes against what he was told to do. And your job, when you are told to do something, you do it. You don't question it. You don't say, okay, let me do it this way instead and maybe I can be the hero. He took it out of the end zone when he was, he was told to kneel down. He took it out of the end zone. He fumbled the goddamn ball. And we lost the game because of that. We at no point in that game lost the game because we were a horrible team. Our defense actually stood up. Our defense actually made sacks. Our defense caused deflections. Jair Alexander was amazing yesterday. How many times have you heard me rave about our defense? You never hear me rave about our defense. I always shit on our defense. They showed up yesterday. Everybody showed up. Devontae Adams was like, this, this is my game, motherfucker. Aaron Rodgers was making Aaron Rodgers throws. I mean, everything was firing on all cylinders. We had a running game. We had everything. Everything. Let me tell you what would happen if I told one of my employees to do something. Something that's very simple, something that's that that's not going to get them in trouble, something that's that's going to benefit everybody in the end, and then they turn around and they do something that ends up costing me and costing costing my company and my store money. You're fired. Like I don't even have to write you up at that point. You are fired. So analytically. 
and I never want to see anybody lose their jobs, guys. But analytically, I am I am perplexed and I am questioning why Ty Montgomery has a job this morning. I'm questioning that, especially with how Joe Williams and how Aaron Jones have been running the ball. We don't need you, buddy. And we got plenty of, of wide receivers. We don't need you. I'm surprised he has his job. You guys leave your comments down below. Let me know what you think. Leave a like on the video. Subscribe if you're new. Enable notifications. Keep up on all the action. And I will see you in the next one, guys.